Hello there, Cancer, and welcome back to another reading with me, Soulful. How are you doing today? I hope that this reading finds you well, and I'm glad to be back. I've been gone for about a month and a half. Gotta, gotta get back into the swing of things. Dealing with actually moving house, believe it or not. Um, so that's coming up for me. And uh, yeah, okay, Cancer. Let's see what's going on with you today. I really want to know what is up with cancer, okay? Source, what is going on with the Cancer Collective? What is going on with the Cancer Collective today? Okay, we have six of coins in the reverse. Knight of coins in the reverse. Okay, so Cancer, interesting, interesting energy here. Um, I feel as though hmm, there's something that is currently lacking in your life that you wish was not. We've got a very slow energy here, but we also have here a, a focused energy on yourself. I, I just love this card. Um, Wow, I'm really drawn to the, the sky behind it. That's the first time I've ever actually really been drawn to like, there's, there's this symbol back there on the card. Cancer, you know, I feel you have been going kind of slow for a while. There's something here that needed to be shared or is not being, it's not an equal exchange, okay? Some of you are really focused, whoa. Cards, cards. Some of you are really focused on your singlehood right now, being single, taking care of yourself, taking care of your inner focus, your inner guidance here. I really feel that. But there's something here that's so slow, it's affecting this. I feel like it is. I, and I don't want to say it's material. It's not really like uh, money. I know we've got the coins here, but it's not really money. It's something else. It has to do with feeling protected. Why is why is this coming from this? It's like a it's like a feeling protected or like I need to protect this. I need to protect these assets or I need to protect myself here. Um with the 6 of coins in reverse, you were dealing in the past with a situation that was quite unfair, okay? And this could be why you're actually single and focused and you know, just kind of like I don't give a fuck. Okay, some of you are just not really giving a fuck. You're going slow. Mm hmm. So let's figure out what's going on here without you giving a fuck, Cancer. Okay. Tell me about the Six of Coins here. Tell me about the Six of Coins here. Okay. We've got Knight of Swords in the reverse, Strength in the reverse, Two of Cups in the reverse. All right, so Cancer, I think there was something incredibly imbalanced going on here in your past energy. Could be a relationship here. Um, something about it, not only was it imbalanced, but it was actually kind of draining you, okay? It was draining your strength. It was draining your resolve, okay? And I feel you may have been dealing with a person, a possible air sign, uh, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. I think you guys all know that by now. <laughs> I think you were dealing with someone that was not willing to communicate with you openly, okay? They weren't sharing with you the same amount of effort that you were putting into them, and this caused a slowdown in your life, okay? And then, and, and with the Two of Cups, it caused an imbalance, especially with the Six of Coins here in the same position. It was not an equal give and take. It was not an equal... Someone may have been breadcrumbing you, I'm hearing, in, and spying on you. Why? Okay, the, or you were spying on them, you were watching them. Okay, there was just a very imbalanced situation here. Some of you may have separated from this person as well, if you, or you stopped being you know, in communication with them. So let's get a look here at the current energy with the Knight of Coins. I feel some of you are in self-preservation mode due to this past situation, okay? Ace of Cups, wow, oh my. Hangman in reverse. 
and Queen of Wands. So Cancer, um, I feel that you have a chance at healing here. There is there is a possibility that this, this Queen of Wands, this is someone else's energy here. Okay, this is your main energy, the Knight of Coins in reverse. With Sagittarius, Leo, or Aries here, someone with great passion, creativity, <clears throat> confidence, uh, clarity of thought too. I'm hearing this. I mean, it's not a swords, but I'm hearing this, uh, someone who has clarity. But they, they, it's like they see you, okay? They see you and they know what you're going through. Um, here with the hangman, you are stopping yourself. Like, you got a slow energy here. You're stopping yourself from this cup here that's being offered. Okay, this could be healing. This could be love. This could be a new start in love. And it could be here with this fire sign, okay? So currently, because of this past situation and the unfairness of it and the um, unequal energy exchange between you and this person, um, we'll, we'll ask about these. Uh, you could have been dealing with a Leo, okay, or an air sign, like I said. Um, this past situation, you know, it's also possible, ooh, that you were trying to rekindle this or you were trying to offer healing to this situation but instead you got hangman in reverse like you were kind of you kind of stuck yourself in a position here okay where they maybe they were moving on or you you know you were trying to move on it wasn't working and then boom someone comes in maybe offers you something okay but you're still heavily focused on this energy here in the present with you know, I've got to protect myself. Maybe, maybe it is even your finances, or maybe I got to protect this past situation. And, you know, you're not letting something in here. You're kind of stuck in your own little situation. This is, this is how it is. This is what I'm seeing. You are forced now to take a look at your own, well, your own slowness, you know, and how you protect yourself. All right. So let's go ahead and take a look at this future energy. Knight of Wands. Buddha Buddha. Knight of Wands. Page of Pentacles. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. And the Fool. All right, Cancer. So I have to say this, and I'm going to only say this once. Only one person can walk away from this, okay? You are single. You have multiple pursuers this is what i'm seeing all right you have maybe um people who have been offering you love while you're focused on this past situation here um page of pentacles the fool um someone with fire in their chart okay this is more than one person's energy that i'm picking up on you have a lot coming towards you okay some of you i heard you may have a friend or someone that you talk to often that is trying to help you through this past situation. Um, so, Like it's someone you see regularly here with the Page of Pentacles that might be uh, trying to get you to like, hey, you know, try something new. They may want to help you to try something new here with the Fool card. You may have had people trying to convince you to get out of this really slow energy that you're in. Okay? Trying to tell you that Try this, try that, do this. And you, but you do have multiple suitors here. You have multiple options here, but you're still stuck in your present energy trying to figure out this past situation, even though you've got offers of love here. Look at this. We have the five of cups. I just noticed it on the bottom of the deck here. Okay, you're still disappointed about this past situation. So some of you are living in the past while you've got a bunch of stuff sitting there waiting for you in the future, okay? So what you do with that information, what you do knowing this is entirely up to you. Do you stay stuck with the hangman or do you move forward towards your options? Okay, so let's go ahead and ask about the two of cups here. Tell me about the two of cups in reverse. There is something really imbalanced here. We've got magician in reverse, okay? So you may have been dealing with someone who has air in their chart, um, but I feel like you got a manipulator on your hands or someone who could not communicate properly with you about this relationship that you were in, okay? So be careful how much um, 
time and energy you invest into this past person because I think you you have healing that is supposed to be coming through and helping you through this okay and uh you're kind of still just like buried here in your own thoughts and observations of this past situation here especially with the magician in reverse okay is this a closed system are you looping around are you cycling around or are you getting yourself loose and you know getting out of this okay tell me about the hangman Ace of Swords right here with the Ace of fucking Cups, okay? And the Hangman. So you're getting communication. You're getting truth. You yourself may be ready to start accepting the truth of this situation. You're just maybe a little bit, you're almost there, okay? Uh, someone may be wanting to communicate with you or you may be wanting to communicate with them. Could be this fire sign or this other fire sign or your Page of Pentacles or another fire sign okay there is <laughs> there is something going on here that um you're just not seeing okay and that is because you're trying to cut through all this bullshit and getting out of this knight of pentacles in reverse which is a very slow stocked energy okay tell me about the fool over here and all these people let's get one clarity card here on this i would like to know about these future possibilities here for cancer thank you source <sighs> wow we have the four of wands okay four of wands this is happiness this is stability there is stability here in the future and some of you need to really hear this right now who are actually stuck in this energy i feel some of you are actually moving into this or you already have um, you understand now that there's stability and happiness in this future, okay, uh, in a new beginning here with the fool. Moving away uh, from this stagnation into something that actually makes you feel freaking stable, okay? And that could be a person, that could be a moving house, that could be, you know, moving jobs. It could be releasing this past situation that it looks like you're separated from someone with, okay? So... Let's go ahead and pull an energy card. Hmm. I like this, you know, two new beginnings here. One in truth and communication and the other in love and healing. So you have a very good energy here moving into the future. All right, Cancer, and I like that. I do. This reading is reminding me of someone right now. I just realized a specific person that I know, okay? So let's go ahead and get this. I want this. I want this energy oracle card. What do we have? Anxiety. Oh my goodness. Cancer and anxiety. How is that possible? No, <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> um, all right. So this explains your knight of coins in reverse here. You are feeling stuck. You have anxiety about the future here. You're unsure. Okay. You're, you're kind of feeling like, um, you're stuck between paying attention to this situation here that was unfair, hoping it heals, or starting another path, okay? Your, your anxiety is going to drive you to make decisions that you don't like, or it's going to drive you to make decisions where you get stuck. So right now, this card, okay, focus, Cancer, focus, okay? Get out of this emotion, I know that's hard, but you can do it. Get out of this anxiety, okay? You need to be a little more realistic, all right, about what's happening. Sit down, write a freaking list of the pros and cons of staying stuck in an energy that's holding you back, okay? Let's get you a monology card, and then we'll get you a lover's card, and we'll take this on over to our extended and we're going to definitely get more advice here of how to break out of this anxiety. Um, that's my job to get you back on your feet and how to get you moving to this new star. I want to take a look at this Queen of Wands here character. These All these people, you seem to have more than one person maybe pursuing you or friends or things around you that are actually really stable and happy. Okay, but you're you're stuck. Okay, some of you are not though. A time to give rather than take. Virgo energy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Let's get you out of this. Uh, you know, give to yourself. Give to those that you care about. Uh, you may want to... Some of you, I'm hearing this. I'm hearing... 
charity work? I don't normally get that with this card, but I am. Charity work, like soup kitchens, pets, like, like, like going to the, um, taking care of, not pets, people, dogs in the, the, uh, the shelters, okay, helping in shelters for homeless. Some of you are considering that that may actually bring you out of this anxiety, like getting out there and doing something that pulls you out of this night of coins in reverse where you've been stopped. Okay, there may be something you want to give instead of always taking, uh, you know, from situations. Uh, this anxiety is also taking away from you. That's something I want to I want to stress. It's taking away from your future happiness here the longer you stay stuck in it, okay? So let's get one more card here, a love card. What do we have? What do we have for Cancer? What do we have, love card? Let there be closeness between you, but always give each other space. Love never claims, it simply allows and gives. There it is, gives. So you may need to give this past person some space here. Okay, you may need to give this this whole situation where you've separated from someone, friend, family, whatever this is, okay, the space it needs to heal with the Ace of Cups because you have love, you have truth, you have things coming in here, okay, in, in your singlehood or whatever it is after you separated here that was, you know, it was manipulative. This energy was not good, okay? The, 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 I feel the situation itself, which we'll dive in in the extended, was affected by perhaps external forces as well, but we'll take a look, and if it wasn't, this person was manipulative, okay, and they were manipulating the situation, there could have been something going on here that they uh, had a, a gain in, okay, there was something here. So, that is what I have for you, Cancer. Please go check out my Patreon page, that's where you can watch this extended, and I hope to see you guys soon here uh, again on my channel, and love you all. Bye.